Hey everybody, it is Card Fighter Hunter, and today I have a very special pack opening. I've got five packs of Aerial Steed Liberation that my sister picked up for me in Japan, um, and I'm very, very appreciative of her. It looks like it was a place called Hobby Station from this, uh, from this, uh, the tape on these packs. So I'm very excited to see what's in here. So let's give it a give it a go. We've got the new Narukami starter. It's pretty cute. Uh, I think this is a new battle sister. Or it might be a Magus. I think it's a Magus. It's got a staff. This is the 12k vanilla for OTT. First rare is the uh, new uh, draw one, discard one for OTT. And then we've got a double rare. This is the new battle sister. Um, so once per turn, when you look at uh, the top card of your deck or something like that, it gains 10k. But it's only once per turn. We got the 16, 16k, 15, uh, can't talk, grade 1, 7k, 15k shield, and then a Narukami uh, critical trigger. Let's see if we can pull the VR. <laughs> the grade 2, 12k for Royal Paladin. I actually don't know what this card is um I'm, i it looks like ott but it could be royal paladin the color balance is all wonky but that's fine um this thing i forget the name of this thing oh this is the new uh it kind of looks like great composure dragon but i don't i'm not super familiar with this set so i'm not sure what this is but uh it's definitely narukami and then for the second rare of the pack we have um, a new Magus card, looks like. Let's take that other rare. Where's that other rare? There it is. And then we got a uh, Narukami Grade 2 and a uh, reprint of the OTT Draw Trigger. We've got the grade one or grade zero Narukami start again. Bark Gull, the new uh, Royal Paladin starter, so that's exciting. Uh, another grade two Narukami unit. Oh, another one of the OTT um, draw triggers. And then one of the Narukami, or um, not draw triggers, Sentinels, sorry. And one of the um, Narukami Sentinels. Reprint of Markle. And the. Uh, uh, Narukami 2 crit 3k uh, thingy got yeah, here. Alright. Got the. Uh, this is the 8k uh, grade 1 that can intercept for, I think, Royal Paladin. I like what they're doing with some of the designs. This is a new Narukami common that doesn't have a marker and I'm not sure what it does but it looks like it gives things 5k power or it gives itself 5k power and then it looks like it does something involving heal triggers I don't know if you can see that mark but something involving heal triggers um this royal paladin dragon thing again wow a third one of this wow I've almost got a playset already and then oh ho 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 triple rare this is, um, this is, I can't remember, I think it's Dorant? Is, is Gold Paladin, I think Gold Paladin is in this deck too, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know the set too well yet. And then, uh, these two again popped up. Last pack. Did pretty good so far. Let's see if we can get that VR or higher. This thing again. Whoops. Let's put these over here. This thing again. This thing again. Alright, I'm gonna save whatever the last uh, foil or rare is for last. We got this, uh, I think this is a gold paladin Ezel thing. I'm not really sure. But it looks cool. Uh, Elaine reprint, and I'm pretty sure we pulled a set of this. Alright, the last rare or foil is. Oh, it is um, the uh, Eradicator Caster. I forget exactly what the new one does, but I think it's something like whenever you bind something, it gets 5k. No, there's a cost there. Discard a card, maybe? 
discard a card and give something 5k. I'm not really sure. But we, we didn't do too bad here. Out of five packs, we got one double rare, one triple rare. Pretty, pretty good. And I love this foil. It's pretty cool. So these are going to go straight in my binder because they look awesome. All right. Thanks again to my sister for buying me these packs. She's right over there. Hi. I think. I think, yeah. And uh, see you guys next time. Thanks. Bye-bye.